And good evening. Thanks for joining us. I'm Russ Spencer. And I'm Sine Simpson. Tom and Marissa have the evening off. Uh, first on Fox 5 News Edge at 11, the city of South Fulton is less than two years old and it's already dealing with gang violence and many of the same problems much older cities are facing. Yeah, but the police department has come up with a plan to stop it. As News Edge reporter Denise Dillon explains, it does seem to be working. Two major busts, 10 arrests just in the past week. Police Chief Keith Meadows says this is significant because with each arrest, one person in that small group of people responsible for the majority of the crimes is off the streets. Drugs, cash, stolen guns confiscated in a bust on Godby Road in the city of South Fulton. It was one of our target locations uh, for heavy gang activity. In the same week, the narcotics unit made a significant bust in the Magnolia Walk community. $36,000 worth of marijuana, pills, cash, and guns. Between the two busts, 10 people arrested, eight in one, two in the other. Detectives are now investigating their involvement with gang activity in the area. We understand the systems that these gangs use. Just like Speaking at this community the meeting Thursday night, the city of South Fulton police chief police Keith Meadows police says police tripling the size of his gang unit is helping to crack down on crimes across the board. That a large number of these gang members were actually involved in a number of our larceny from vehicles and slider crimes as well. So it became extremely important for us to identify who they were. Chief Meadows is definitely doing that, helping to increase the quality of our lives there by getting these gang members off the streets of the city of South Fulton. Chief Meadows says they're working with other police agencies because gang members don't understand boundaries. After meeting with a number of the agencies throughout the Atlanta metropolitan area, we're tracking almost 200 different gangs, uh, not just in the city of South Fulton, but throughout the region. At the community meeting, the chief also talked about repeat offenders and how he is working with the courts to make sure they stay in jail as long as possible. In the city of South Fulton, Denise Stillen, Fox 5 News.